Hi, I'm Tiana. And I'm Adrienne. And this is Tiana and Ace Taste. Welcome back to our channel. On today's video, we're going to be doing a refrigerator tour, just kind of showing my refrigerator organization products that I have and kind of the general food items that would be in there on a given time. To my fridge. So to start off, I have these acrylic containers that I got on Amazon. I'll make sure I link them down below, but I find these extremely helpful just to keep the fridge organized um, and kind of just less cluttered looking. So to start off on the top, we kind of keep our peanut butter and almond butter in here. Um, and there's some Greek yogurt in the back. That's my husband's. In here, I keep all the zevias and kind of dips um, or if there's any like leftover, um, you know, like the pasta sauce or anything, I keep it in here. This is um, some of the like fruits that we want to make sure that we see so that they don't go bad too quickly. So all the berries are in here. This is more dairy. So, you know, the non-dairy butter and then non-dairy sour cream, cream cheese, and then all the kind of shredded cheeses are behind that. Moving on to this drawer, I keep like deli meat if we have any, um, you know, the pepperoni. There's also a couple packages of turkey bacon and sliced cheese goes in here. Eggs, obviously self-explanatory. Um, and this one, I keep my onions and then I also have some garlic in the back and some ginger. And next to that would be potatoes. So whether it be sweet potatoes or regular potatoes, they go in here. <laughs> I don't know if you can see these little baby ones, but these I grew in my garden. They're fingerling potatoes. Just Aww, a couple left. They're so cute. Yes, mom is the cameraman today. <laughs> and then in this container, we use one of the bigger ones for leftovers. So there's, um, you know, just some leftover roasted vegetables in the back right now. And then over here is kind of the drink section, but I also keep some maple syrup down in the back. Um, we have another large one down in our... Um, we have a fridge down in the basement for some of the overflow. So my husband's iced coffee um, right now, you know, we're close to Thanksgiving. So we have some nog um, also can go obviously into the Christmas season. Um, some apple cider behind that. I just have a couple juices and then um, the non-dairy milk. So I actually have an almond milk and an oat milk back there. I like that Oatly brand. I have some of that in my refrigerator right now. <laughs> and then over here I have typically like salad-y vegetables. So whether it be, you know, spinach, iceberg lettuce, I also have some celery here. Um, basically things that are a little bit too big to put into the drawer. And in the drawer right now I have the leftover, well, some portion of cucumber and then some carrots right now. And then in the other side I keep the fruit. So avocados, apples, lemons. Um, typically, oh, there is a lime. I usually have lemons and limes. Um, and then on the door, I feel like this is something that everyone's looks messy because <laughs> you just inevitably have a lot of items in a small area. But we have some pickles up here. Um, ignore my medications, but they have to be refrigerated. <laughs> um, I have a soup that I do have open. This is something that would normally be in the pantry. I keep my dates in the fridge. They stay a lot longer. Um, and I like to cut them up and add them on top of salads just to give like a little sweetness. Um, and then all the mustards here, ketchup, kind of Asian condiments. Um, and here's just like a bunch of random little items, you know, garlic, some sauces, uh, lemon juice, lime juice. And then down here is kind of all the other overflow. So this ginormous thing of salsa, um, my maple syrup, agave nectar, um, and then really just kind of a host of, you know, barbecue sauce, salad dressings, that kind of thing, and a little bit of mayo. Um, but that is what is in my fridge, um, which is all gluten-free and probably all dairy-free, if I'm thinking about it. <laughs> um, hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for joining us. We hope you liked the video. And if you did, be sure to like this video, subscribe for more from us, and then leave comments down below. And if you want to show us your refrigerator, you can post something on Instagram and tag us at Tiana and Ace Taste.